so fucking bored talking to these boys, you know, about mm, they might come, they might not, talk to my agent, meh, 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 you know, <laughs> like, please, you know. Well, you, you do the act of the room. Yeah. Um, <laughs> now, this is really pathetic, you know, because they are in this kind of group of, we'll make, you know, this is, you know, bankable actors. And I thought this is actually also very restrictive, you know, why am I looking at white boys, you know, when actually there's some fantastic black actors out there as well. And it raises a very interesting issue. What's the difference? What's the difference between a black actor and a white actor? The answer is quite a lot, actually, in terms of audience perception. However, in terms of, audience, in terms of acting ability, Wesley Slipes is a genius actor. I'd seen him do very serious roles. He also came out of New York, La Mama, this kind of alternative you know, theater thing. So I had no problem relating to Wesley Snipes as soon as I met him, and I, I had a great respect for him. And I said to him, listen, I've written this script. I'll be honest, I wrote this for Nick Cage, um, and I'm not going to change it. Uh, I'm not going to make it a black part. And he went, thank you. Um, he said, I just ask you one favor. When you film One Night Stand, and you do a scene between me and Nastasia Kinski, the, the cinematographer, is he going to expose for her skin or mine? Because if he exposes for her skin, I disappear. If you expose for me, she'll just be a white blur. So I'm just telling you, technically that will be your challenge. I am black, she's white, you know. And I'm not, I'm not like light brown, you know. I am actually, I have dark skin. And you're going to have to make a technical decision about how you film the scenes between us which we then, we then dealt with. Um, and that had never been pointed out to me before. Wow. Alors voilà, votre, 